Try the screens. It's all around us. Tom, your arm. Part of that creature touched you. It's eaten right through the suit. Like, like Sam. You better get out of that. I'll get the myosin compound just in case. Give me that suit, Tom. We'll put it in the disposal unit. Iris, what is your opinion of that creature? Well, I'm sure it's a unicellular animal. There's two areas inside it must be the nucleus and the contractile vacuole. Oh, wait a minute. Whoa. <laughs> Let me in on it, virus, huh? It's like an amoeba, Tom. A giant amoeba. One single cell without intelligence, without a nervous system at all. Reacts completely on instinct to external stimuli. No, we must be safe in here. The amoeba engulfs its prey and digests it with extremely strong acids. It's, it's trying to get to us. It's incredible. Well, I wouldn't say that, Tom. Not after what we saw it do to poor Sam. Yeah. It'll take time, but it probably can eat right through the ship. Well, we've got to get rid of it some way. But how? Can't even be touched with anything we have. Iris, you've experimented with amoeba on Earth. What sort of thing affects them? They're almost impossible to kill. Even if you cut them in half, both parts will live. Well, there's got to be some way to get at it. It can insist, Tom. That is, secrete and form a sort of protective envelope. That's how it withstood the sonic gun. Heat, fire. I could turn on the rocket. Oh, you can't do that, Tom. With that creature clogging our thrust chamber, we'd have an internal explosion. Oh, well, we got to do something. I can't think of anything. Hey, wait a minute. I do remember. We experimented with electricity. What happened? Well, the, the power from a small flashlight battery killed thousands of amoeba. That's it, electric shock. I can generate half a million volts. But how are you going to get to it to electrocute it? You can't go outside or, or even open the airlock. I won't have to. But what I have in mind could backfire. If you both don't agree, I won't go through with it. What is your plan, Tom? I'll need your help. Check me out. This ship has a double hull, right? That's correct. The outer hull acts as a meteor bumper. And the outer hull is completely insulated from the inner one? It's quite effectively. Good. Now, is there any way I can get to the outer hull from in here? One place only. The detector instrument cable access channel. I want to feed the radar power through the outer hull. Can it be done? Well, it would take a lot of rewiring, but yes, we can do it. You see, what I have in mind is to feed the current through the outer hull without it spilling back into the inner one. What do you think? And if there is a spill? Then we won't have to wait for that thing to eat through to us. Well, I'm for it. So am I. Good. Let's go. 